fix myself well. Let me fix the way they did these braids, you guys. I'm not happy. They're supposed to be full, but look at the hair. It looks like it's almost flat here, but it has fullness here. Ah, these people are trying to get cheap with braids, though. They're trying to get cheap. Ah, and I'm trying to hide my sports bra, so <laughs> ah, it's not working. It's not working. Anyway, let me sit well. Let me sit well. How are you guys doing? So the reason for this video, as you can see in the title, is no more life as is. Um, I wanted to come out and do this video to kind of like talk to you guys about the reason why I'm making this transition. So when I first started this channel was around 2020 or so. And I started, I started off even with a completely different name. And honestly, it's because I had no idea what exactly I wanted to do with the channel. All I knew was I want to create a channel and see how many people I can connect with, period. Just like Instagram, just like Facebook, you know, just like, uh, what's the other one? Snapchat, just like that. And also because I honestly love creating videos. I've always been into the editing scene since high school. So I thought, oh, this is a fun thing to do anyway. So why not? But I never really had a specific end goal at that point. But now as I've grown within YouTube and have really discovered where my passion is, I decided to focus on a specific name. And this, when you listen to a lot of the YouTubers, um, the big, big YouTubers out there, they tell you, just start YouTube. If you love making videos, if you love creating, if you love connecting with people, if you love creating a community, just start. And that's exactly what I did. And I'm so happy that I did because there are, now that I'm seeing that I'm starting to gain some traction and I'm starting to, you know, come in contact with like minded people on youtube i'm like hey, hey, hey let me be careful of what i put out here oh, let me be careful because i need to do this thing called branding rebranding <laughs> because people are calling my parents telling them that from somewhere in italy they are seeing my face i'm like hey, hey it has happened <laughs> so i said you know what let me also do this thing called rebranding rebrand myself okay so let's rebrand this channel together we are rebranding because life as is is great so let me tell you first of all the story behind life as is life as is was because i love to enjoy life exactly how it is i'm somebody who doesn't wait for tomorrow too much i do still be cautious i don't overspend i don't splurge i'm not that type of person you see it on my channel i don't do that but I'm also the kind of person who likes to give thanks to God now. Because sometimes when we wait too much for the future because we're like, oh, this hasn't happened. Oh, this doesn't, this and that. Hey, you tend to, you tend to lose sight of what you got. You tend to lose sight of saying, thank you, Lord, for what I have today. Enjoy today. So that's where the name Life As Is came about. But then over time, I realized that, you know what? The content that I'm putting out because of what I'm interested in is more about Ghana. It's more about trying to connect with people in the diaspora who are just like me, were first generation immigrant children. Well, now I'm an adult who need and want and desperately yearn to connect to their roots. You know, there's a bridging gap between um, us the diaspora first generation born children and Ghanaians in Ghana. Um, it's, it's, it's simply because we were born and raised abroad and it's not so easy to understand some of the, 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 the deep rooted cultural differences that there are between Ghana, Ghana and, or in Ghana and in the States or wherever Western um, area you're in. So I wanted to create this channel to have a space for us, uh, first generation, um immigrant diaspora wherever you want to call it <laughs> because now i'm getting confused to be able to share the space to learn from each other to get to know each other to build a community that is purpose is to be positive exert positivity about africa so that we can bring more positivity into us that's the space that i want to create and hence rooted diasporans because we are so rooted into getting to know about our culture. You know, I try to speak tree and people laugh at me. And sometimes I get mad to some of my uncles and aunties or brothers and sisters who be laughing at me when I'm trying to speak tree because they don't, that is not encouraging, that's embarrassing. It's almost telling me that I'm trying too hard to be what I am, you know? So then I don't want to look stupid. So then I, I just don't speak it because I just don't want to look stupid. I want to look like I'm trying too hard. But all I'm really trying to do is really learn the language and really 
be Ghanaian, like what I truly am. Sometimes I, I laugh and I tell my parents, like, I feel like we're lost children, of lost African children, which is something I thought I should name my channel about also. But then I said, you know what, that might, that, that might not be right either. So, but anyway, sometimes I feel like we're like that because, you know, we try to speak our language. They laugh at us and then we feel ashamed and we don't want to speak our language. And then sometimes we don't speak our language and then still they'll start making, they'll start behaving as if you're trying to be bougie kind of thing or like you don't want to speak the language or you just want to speak English. So sometimes you just don't even know how to exactly be around your own people, you know? So I decided, you know what? This is who I am, how I am. I'm gaining traction. People are watching my videos. They're calling my parents from somewhere in Italy that they see my face. They've seen this and that and that. I'm like, you know what? This is the time. Let's rebrand. Let's do this. Let's create a space where we talk about Africa positively. We learn about Africa positively. We talk about our challenges. We talk about solution. We don't complain, but we talk about the challenges. And again, we talk about solution. So hence, once again, I introduce to you my new rebranded, rebirthed channel, Rooted Diasporans. <laughs> How did you like my intro? I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, don't forget to comment, like, share, and subscribe. And if anybody gets confused and you know whoever else is subscribed to my channel just like you are, let them know that this girl is just can't make up her mind and she just changed the name of her channel one more time. But hopefully this is the last time. Thank you so much for watching. Until next time. Ciao.